Shannon, thank you. I want to bring in WFLA's Evan Donovan, who's joining me now from the Tampa newsroom. Evan, we talked about at the top of the show here that Florida court hearing on mask mandates today. You are in the center of it. I know this is what you cover on the reg. Talk to us about what's happening. Yeah, so it just started just a few minutes ago, and here's the background for how we got here. Two weeks ago, Judge John Cooper ruled in favor of the plaintiffs, the families in this case, who had sued Governor Ron DeSantis and the Florida Department of Education. The judge found in a verbal ruling read aloud from the bench that the governor and the Department of Education acted unlawfully, exceeding their constitutional authority in effectively banning mask mandates. The state then appealed that ruling last week as soon as the written order was entered. By law, that then automatically stays his order. The families then filed a motion to vacate that stay, and that's where we are here today. Interestingly, the same judge who heard this case in trial court is the one who will hear this motion mm -hmm. to vacate the stay today. So. After today, we will find out whether or not school districts will be able to require masks in schools while this case moves through the appeal process. Hallie. Evan Donovan, it's great to have you. Thank you for making the time for us this morning. Cal Perry, Shannon Pettypiece, thank you as well. I want to bring in now NBC News medical contributor Dr. Natalie.